Tonight, a Colorado Springs father is desperate for answers and an arrest following the death of his 19-year-old son. Santiago Calleros III was shot and killed at the El Moro Mobile Home Park in July of 2022, leaving behind a three-year-old daughter. Here to 13's Annabelle Childers is live at the Colorado Springs Police Operations Center to explain where this investigation stands. Annabelle. A year and a half later, Colorado Springs police have not made any arrests in the death of Santiago Calleros III. Tonight, Santiago's father is begging anyone with information to come forward. He's only 19 years old. That's why I call him a kid. I mean, he was, he was a man, but I mean, he was still a kid. At age 19, Santiago Calleros III led a busy life. The father of this little girl and also a successful Chicano rapper, Santiago was known by his fans as Little Travieso. You can just Google his name, he's all over the internet. But on July 6th, 2022, Santiago's life came to a screeching halt. I don't even know. How else to describe it? It is devastated. Santiago's dad says he got the call his son had been shot at the El Moro Mobile Home Park late that July night. Colorado Springs police say their officers responded to the area and paramedics tried to save him, but Santiago died from his gunshot wounds. His rap dream and the dream of, you know, leaving behind the namesake was basically taken away by that coward that night. A year and a half after Santiago's death, his father still questions what happened. Their family has put up billboards, taped flyers, and begged the community to come forward, but nothing. You almost start to feel like your uh, efforts are, you know, for worthless. At the time of his death, Santiago's father says he was involved in a gang. He fears those ties are causing the police department to invest less time in solving the case. But CSPD says Santiago's affiliation with gangs is not factoring into their efforts. They say they desperately need witnesses to come forward. Anyone with information in Santiago's death is urged to contact Crime Stoppers. They're currently offering a $10,000 reward for any information that leads to an arrest. Reporting live in Colorado Springs, Annabelle Childers, KRDO 13. Annabelle, thank you.